doing the everybody's story in a little bit. All right, good morning, guys. It is going to be another day here in LA. If you guys haven't been following the series and you guys haven't seen the Invasion of Los Angeles movie and also the behind the scenes series, definitely check that out. But today we're going to take you guys behind the scenes of a Every Bell's a Story. I know we've been revamping those series up and today we're going to be talking about a unique build. Corey has talked about this car, spoke highly about it, and we're going to hear the story behind it and also see all the fine details in this build. But we're going to talk with Miguel and see what he thinks about this whole thing and about LA and stuff because I know he's been here for a couple days already and uh, let's get to it. Yeah, so absolutely uh, weather wise, it's great, right? Um, different than Florida because you don't have that constant sweating of humidity, but the car scene, very similar. Um, when we go to these car meets and, and talk to other BMW enthusiasts, it's just like family, right? It doesn't matter what walks of life you have or what culture you come from. We have that common, I would say passion about BMWs and about the car scene that it's just super fun. Yesterday we had a great time and a little pre-meet we had with some of the top builds and YouTubers. So it was just a great time. And, and it doesn't really matter where we are, whether we're on the East Coast or on the West Coast, the BMW community is probably the best community out there. Grizz, what do you think? It was pretty cool, not gonna lie. It was uh, definitely a unique spot to have a little meet. And from what I was told, that is like one of the spots to be at when the car meets are out. Um, a lot of cool cars we saw yesterday uh, and uh, it just makes me even more excited for what we're going to see at the show because I mean just from that little gathering a bunch of cool people cool builds that we got to check out so really looking forward to uh, everything we got ahead this weekend yeah and this is filmed before the show so we have no idea how it's going to be like but again you're going to see that video before this video but we'll check in with John real quick John what do you think we're having a good time. We've had a lot of good little experiences here and there. Uh, working on the event venue, getting everything going with that. And just gonna do our work and have a good time with everybody we meet and put on a good show with you guys. And John's been doing all the drone footage, so enjoy that B-roll. And he, he got really good shots yesterday, so definitely check that out. Thanks, guys. All right, so here at AR Motor Works, and we're gonna be doing the Every Buzz story in a little bit. We're gonna get the vehicle here, and you guys are gonna see it. Um, something about AR Motor Works, they've been around for quite a bit, and we'll probably talk to one of the owners just to show you guys a little bit about the business, and something to talk about them. They do a lot of wheels. They do a lot of BBS wheels, and that's something that you guys seen on their Instagram. And to be honest, they do some really good work. I already took a little peek already and you can see them working hard on the next batch of orders. All right, so one of the that things that's pretty cool is that the owner, Ron, he has a G80 M3 manual comfort seats, but what I was looking at that really drew me was actually these BBSs. 20s in the front, and you got 21s in the rear. Just check out that fitment. And that's like hella flush. And 21s maybe, in some people's opinion, may look too big, but I think this looks amazing. So again, guys here at AR, a lot of other companies and distributors do use them to uh, build their wheels. So ladies and gentlemen, this is your subject today. We're gonna to be talking to Farves about his G20 and individual wrapped, I would say, Laguna Seca Blue, right? Yes, sir. And we're gonna be doing every buzz of story. So stay tuned. I know we've everybody behind watching. Miguel is gonna be asking the questions. You'll see the behind the scenes. And how you feeling right now? Good, man, excited. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Uh, you know, it's great. 
I want people to hear the story. People ask me all the time, so let's let's get yeah. this going. And one of the best things is you're just talking about your car. So yeah. it's just talking about your car, having a conversation, and talking about your passion. BMWs, right? Yes, sir. Thank you. And I definitely want to get the owner of AR here, and just to give thanks about letting us use his studio and also using uh, his shop because we are slowing some things down in his uh, place of business. All right. So one of the best things about coming here is that we love wheels. Miguel has like seven sets of BBS wheels. But something about wheels is that the proper fitment, right? You guys want the fitment where you don't need spacers. And to be honest, the guys here at AR Motorworks, they do that for you guys. Miguel. Yeah, so I, we would definitely want to talk to the owner of AR Motorworks to figure out what does it take, right? If Absolutely. someone comes and you know you just bought a new BMW and you want the right fitment, right? You want the nice flush fitment, but it's all depends on your style, right? Absolutely. You Absolutely. can get a little bit aggressive, a little bit conservative. It, there's, so. there's tuner fitments, there's literally track fit JDM, right? Yeah, exactly. It really comes down to what suspension you want to run, but you know, cars are like politics, you know, to each their own, there's no right from wrong. It's a mat it's a matter of what you want to get out of it. So over here, we do try to get you what you want, whether it's hella flush fitment, whether it's conservative fitment, you want meaty, you want more lip, that's what we're here for. So that's So if someone comes in, you got a new client, he comes in, he's like, guide me. Yeah. What, what do you do? I would talk, I, talk that conversation. Here's a good example. Okay. okay. My wheels. You know what wheels I have, right? Yeah. In order to build those set of wheels, right? And you were just telling me, it takes six different wheels. Six wheels. So it really depends on what configuration you okay. want. Obviously, what you got is creme de la creme, all BBS barrels, BBS centers. And to make his setup, he has a G80 M3. Uh, we took six original BBS wheels, basically trashed two centers and took their barrels to essentially make what he wants. But I mean, you don't have to do it. The way he did it is more of the baller way. This guy's a baller, I guess. Yeah. He's my cousin, we look the same. <laughs> what the Tell fuck, I don't even it's... know, man. We kind of look the same, right? <laughs> hey, you guys are racist if you say that, all right? <laughs> but anyways, besides that, um, we do two-piece configurations like what he did, and we also do three-piece, which is essentially, yeah. you know, bigger lips, um, and you can really cater from inner to outer. And for me, like your setup, yeah. yours is like a true, functional setup you got decent sized lip and you know it's one of my favorite set yeah. setups personally but and it's all bbs stuff yep. for us when we do three piece we still use all aluminum die cast forged parts but it's not all original bbs stuff that's a difference so now so, i know why i paid that high price tag <laughs> but um again it's not for everybody but there's also different options out there but we definitely want to thank you for allowing thank us you. to use your showroom to absolutely film absolutely this absolutely. next every bells a story but anything else you want to say to people because i know we'll check in with you later on Nothing much, man. Welcome. Right. <laughs> Welcome, right. guys. All right. Yeah. All right, so let's get to the Every Buzzer story. Stay tuned, guys. Three, two, one. All right, so let us know what your name is, your IG handle, and what you do for a living. Hey, guys, uh, my name is Fars. My IG handle is Laguna G20, and I am in the cannabis industry out here in California, Los Angeles. All right, so normally that when you do a build and stuff, you want to acknowledge some of the people that worked on your car, right? So, Favre, who do you want to thank? You know what, I forgot two people that worked on my car other than Ron here. Number one is Arvin at APX Motorsports. I gotta give him a huge shout out because he's worked on my car for so long now, since day one, rewrapping parts, taking parts apart, fitment issues. When you build a car this much with this many customization parts, you need a good wrap guy. And number two, my mechanical guy, which is uh, Iman, tech underscore Iman. He's amazing as well. He's done all my installations. So I want to give a shout out to those two guys. Thank you. All right, so Ron, I want to thank you for letting us use your showroom and also taking up a lot of your time. Oh, you're absolutely fine. Uh, Always welcome, guys. Always cool. welcome. Yeah. Um, and you'll catch some at the show. You won't see this video until probably like a month, month and a half, because I got to get the other footage out first. Um, but it's also good to show local BMW enthusiasts here in California. And we have one tomorrow that we're going to San Diego, and I'm out looking forward to that drive. <laughs> but uh, Ron, anything to say to people? How can they reach you? And, you know, the best fitment, go custom. <laughs> Guys, feel free to see us on our social media presence. It's at AR underscore MotorWorks. Uh, you could always give us a call and uh, ask for me, guys. I'll be more than happy to take care of you guys. And other than that, I hope you guys see all the whips we bring out to Beamer Invasion. And I uh, hope you guys enjoy the episode. If yeah. they miss this weekend, yeah. what do you have to tell them? If you miss this weekend, um, we will have a lot of footage overviewing the whole show. 
And uh, it's gonna make you feel bad because you missed it. Yeah, exactly. You're gonna feel bad as well. So just catch the footage if you can, if you can make it to the show. Uh, hoping to see all you guys there. So yeah, thank you guys. All Appreciate right. it. Yeah. All right, so now is the time that we're gonna go inside the minivan, get the rollers, get those beauty shots that you're gonna enjoy. And you're kind of enjoying right now over me talking. So stay tuned, a ton of footage coming. Let's go. Wrapping things up here in the Valley Heat. Um, it's pretty hot out here. Uh, Dave, I want to thank Farves for uh, allowing us to tell his story about his car. You know, we haven't really done a G20 recently, and uh, it's good to see somebody in LA and talk about his story. And the hospitality in LA has been absolutely incredible, right? Between AR Motor Works, Farves, and then the rest of the people that were in that pre meet. If you haven't seen that video, definitely check that video out. But um, we got some really good shots. Yeah, you guys wanna, are seeing it now yeah. in the behind the scenes. Thank you guys too for coming out yeah. and taking your time doing all this. We're hanging outside on the freeway and you know going ham to make this video come true. And you guys are gonna love it. Whatever this guy puts out in the team, it's top notch quality and it's gonna be amazing. Yeah, you're gonna see the behind the scenes right now, obviously, and also the movie for the invasion of Los Angeles and also Every Buzz a Story. We're gonna be starting off with his Everybody has a story. Then we have an E46 wagon that we're going to be doing tomorrow in San Diego. And that's wow. going to be a drive. That's nice. So stay that's tuned nice. for that vlog. That one's going to be pretty interesting. And you don't see that, right? It's the mastermind Beautiful. behind the thought of it and making it happen. So yeah. other than that, that's it. Thank it's you, guys. Appreciate it. All right, brother. Thank you.